Today I'm going to show you three short stories about the historical city that we live in, Oxford. Oxford used to be called Oxen of Fallen, which translates to Fallen of the Oxen. In modern day, this means that the cows used to frequently travel across the river. Today's first story will be about a man named Lewis Carroll, who took a girl named Alice to leave his rainbow. The second story will be about how Thomas Cramner came to find himself being burnt on a stake. And the last will be about a man who said he distinguished every animal from the taste of his flesh. So make sure you are comfortable, listen carefully, and prepare to find out more about the wonderful. Thomas was 68 years old, and he accepted that 
that he was going to die. As Thomas calmly walked up to the stake, Oxford's famous clock tower struck free. The crowd fell silent. You could hear the creaking as they winched the pyre up. It was widely reported that when he stood on the stake, he was calm and dignified, even when the pyre was lit. It is said that he let his right hand be burnt first as a symbol of God taking his hand up his head. If you venture down to St. Giles in Oxford, in the middle of the road is a plaque that is a remembrance of Thomas Cranmer and all the other men and women who were burnt by Queen Mary for the religion that they followed. Wow, you've really got me there. I have never tasted that animal before. 